You know, when I was 15, I was Miss Teen Oklahoma. Interesting. Well, I've written two best-selling poker books, and I'm six foot nine. Amazing. From 10 feet away, I can throw a playing card through a carrot. Miss Oklahoma, good. Oklahoma. To learn, chat, and play with the pros, go where they live. FullTiltPoker.net. Our letter has come by, as you can see, to help us tune up our Limit Hold'em games. Today was the $1,500 Limit Hold'em event at the World Series of Poker, the first one. And uh, I just feel like people don't care that much about Limit Hold'em out there. People say it's a dying game, it could be a dead game, and I want to uh, see if we can get people excited about it again. Maybe you can get, show me the ropes. I'm certainly not a good player. so Yeah, I, I would say actually that Limit Hold'em certainly is not a dying game. It is becoming a smaller portion of the market, I guess, because so many people see No Limit on TV, and that's the game that they're going to start playing. You know, some people are really good at No Limit type games, and some people are good at Limit games, and I think the players that start playing No Limit, and then maybe decide, hey, let me give Limit Hold'em a try, and they see that they're really good at Limit Hold'em, they're going to start playing that game. It's just going to take some time. Do you think that an impatient player uh, such as myself is better suited to play No Limit Hold'em, Limit Hold'em, or is there any game really where you can be impatient? King 8 here, offsuit. I'd say you'd lay it down, you particularly it down. for a raise. Okay. Um, I would say for impatient people, poker's not maybe the best <laughs> game, but uh, I'd say you, you at least have like a puncher's chance in No Limit. Right. Um, in Limit, if you're just going to be playing too many hands, you're going to get ground down. Is we're folding the jacks out. I think we got to give it up. Now we have to fold again. Terrible. It's another unplayable hand for me. It the certainly class is, is very hard. The rules are very strict. <laughs> they should call you the dry cleaner instead. You're just folding constantly <laughs> instead of the professor. They probably better. Yeah. Oh. I'm putting the full tilt poker jersey on. That could be the answer. That could be the answer to the question. Perhaps it knows New the jersey. Uh, race King it up seven. here. Come on, we're gambling it. now. All right, we're gambling now. King seven of hearts. We've gotten short-handed. Everyone, it's a fold to us. We're in cutoff. I would love to win the button here with a raise. Uh, looks like we might. He's thinking about it. Yep, he folded. Look at that. We stole antis. We, we, stole we just stole antis in a play money sit and go. We're, I'm very pleased. we're not going to show them what we're stealing. <laughs> uh, it's ah, we're all paired up here. Oh, got a raise. Raising. Is that also because we're shorthanded if we're under the gun in a full ring, we're not raising Under the gun, full ring, we might even fold two we fours in fold. a very wow. serious game, yes. But we are going to play two fours here in a five-handed game. They almost look like aces. I would just want to raise those under the gun. No yeah, I do I hate that when I'm I squeezing like. in the fours <laughs> in, in a live game. We want to thid the field here, maybe maybe get called by an ace. Okay. Of course, if we get played with, we're going to slow right down. So let's so bet. we're betting it out? All yeah, right. for sure. If we can get this thing heads up with an ace, which is a definite possibility here, we really do ourselves a great service. Now, I've heard check raising is fun. When do I get to do that? When does that lesson come in? Um, because we didn't, have, we haven't had a chance to check. We just keep betting our hands out. Well, let's check it again. We're checking it again. All yeah. right. I think we check raised when, when we were drawing dead earlier. Didn't we check raise with the ace deuce when the other guy flopped the set? Uh, I, th I think did we, we did. Oh, yes, okay. I think we did, and then we got promptly three bet. <laughs> so, <laughs> so our first attempt to check raising in this didn't go. It didn't work so well. Look at that. The two fours took it down. We got called by three people. We'd like I to get to the money here, at least. I'd, I'd want to at least get us to the cash. Right. To I the think that's play cash. I think that's, that's going to be important, yeah. yeah. If not, I think that it's possible that the whole Howard Letter or Mystique could just completely crumble up based on right. this one sit-and-go. If I can't cash in a play money <laughs> sit-and-go. Great. He doesn't win the main. We're one step closer to the money. Look at the, We are in the money. We're in the money. We're, we're in, in the, the money. money. Me there time just knocked out two players in the same hand. We have cashed. We have cashed. And we just picked up the blinds. We're yeah, on a we roll got here. A, we got a we got a, uh, a walk, as they say. Ten five. We can limp in. We can limp. Okay. Not a good hand, but you know we're getting a big price here. Let's bet. We're gonna bet. You know we could just be up against nobody. Not likely either player is an ace or a king. I'm gonna continue the bluff. I, I just. All right. Did I act a little too fast there? Might have that been a click tell? I haven't been acting that quickly. Oh, now I, I just, just think let's put some it. pressure on this guy. Right. Yeah. Now that now, now we're playing the game. Can we show him a bluff? Sure. Uh, oh, all right. We'll show him a bluff next time. 
<laughs> Let's give this one up. We're going to give it up? Okay. Yeah, we just got to keep them off, you know. Oh, Ace King. Yikes, we need a nine ball here. There, there we go. Wow. Just what we needed. Just what the doctor ordered or the professor ordered. A nine ball on Fifth Street. Well, we're down to heads up. Yeah, heads up. A two to one chip lead. Let's raise it. I'm, I don't know where we're in the big blind. Sorry. In the big blind. Can we get one up high? Okay. That's what I'm saying. One up high for the donkey. I told him that Howard and I just high fived, and he can watch it tomorrow at cardplayer.com. How does the strategy change here? Heads up in limit. Well, heads up, I like to play just about every hand. Let's let's check. Okay. Um, and I like to raise on the button. I like to call. Um, let's bet. I mean, he limped in. Doesn't look like he started with much of a hand here. And we're and we're going to start probing. Uh, what is this? The dad. The dad. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Um, let's raise. I really, I really like playing a very aggressive heads-up game. Dad is just not. It's not going away. It's not going away. He just keeps hanging around on us. More full tilt players coming in here to help out the, he the heads up match. I mean, let's put it this way. We played a hand against the dad where we check raise with the 9 8 on an ace 4 4 flop, and he called us with 9 6 and, and right. caught a 6 on us. I said, now you're playing with Howard Litter, Gavin Smith, and Joe Seabach, but he's not going to believe me again. Well. Do, should I get good game ready in the chat box? That might be good. Yeah, of course. Well, oh. well you're pretty much going to call, aren't you? Yeah, so. Yeah, we're going to call. I want last click here. Yeah, he might not pay you off with Ace. With call here? Got a call. You got a call for sure. Ace. Five. Ace five. Five. Okay, Mark very nice hand. Good game. <laughs> very <laughs> nice hand. So we finished second, Howard. It's a good, it was a good shot. We took it. The dad just seemed to outthink us there. Heads you know, up. the dad played well. It was a long, hard fought battle, but uh, he certainly it was a well deserved win. Second place, not terrible. I mean, you nope. had me on your team, which wasn't very good. There's <laughs> better, there are better picks out there. We appreciate you taking the time to uh, show us a little bit about Lim and Holdem and about Full Tilt. It was my pleasure, Scott. All right. Had a great Thanks time. A lot. Thanks.